Hi guys, today I'm gonna show you how to put like grip tape, rip tape, like low pro tape, any kind of like tape on a fingerboard. This is stuff you're gonna need. Your piece of tape, your deck, and the scissors or something like that's like a sharp metal point. And uh, this is what I like to do first. I just peel it off, obviously. I have put it down on the opposite side, like that, the sticky side. And I take my deck and I just lay it on top, like that, just to make sure it's all nicely aligned. Then I press down, make sure there's no air bubbles or anything. And then I take the back of my scissors, you know, like whatever, and I scrape along the edges and it gives it this nice cut here here and then like just peel it off and I just saved it for non slide uh, just go all the way around the deck and it looks a lot nicer than a regular cut when people just take their scissors and cut it that way this, this looks a lot better. It looks like pre-cut and it's pretty much just perfect. So like, I suggest you use this method. And you can do the same with like grip tape too. You just gotta like get a razor or something and cut around the edges. And this is gonna take a while, like a couple minutes. Shouldn't take that long though. Just keep on like scraping around the deck until you get everything off. Uh, it's gonna be a little messy. Well, not around the edges, but I don't know. Got my table all dirty. Keep on going around it, just, <clears throat> just like that. Just keep on peeling it off and like just putting it on the backing. In this FPS, it feels just like worn and rip tape right out of the package. It feels a lot smoother too. Uh, yeah, here it is. Looks pretty good. Uh, now I just like just take my fingers and just rub it around the edges until it looks perfect. And yeah, yeah it looks just like pre-cut. You can do a better job. See, it's like I do the same method on this deck. And uh, yeah, looks almost perfect. So uh, I hope you learned something. And, uh, yeah.